Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to import our latest edition, the AI template. Uh, I'm using the 2018.2, yeah, just create a new project, there's nothing imported yet, just the basic stuff that comes when you create a new, a new project with this version. Uh, since the as, as of this date, the AI template is not yet approved in the asset store, I'm going to import a custom package with our first beta version. Uh, here you can see we have just a asset importer script that will verify if you have already any uh, third-person controller template of Invector, of course, in your project because we built the AI template using several shared assets like 3D models, animations, uh, some prefabs and several generic scripts. So instead of duplicating uh, those files to uh, have a gigantic project, we used um, several of those assets. So we created basic essential package packages of the basic melee and shooter uh, templates. So in this case, since I don't have uh, any third-person controller template by Invector in the project, I will hit import. Now that we import the asset importer, uh, this script will verify that we don't have any of the third-person controllers by Invector in the project. So we will extract the basic melee and shooter essentials pack uh, and then import the AI template. Let's hit import essentials. This will take a while, so I will cut here and be right back. Cool, now that we successfully import the AI template with our essentials package, we can close this window and open uh, our demo scenes. You will notice that now you have the Invector third person controller folder and the AI controller. The third person controller does not include, of course, the the controllers, but only the essentials like 3D models, audios, etc. Now, if for some reason the AI controller uh, content is not here, was not imported, you can always import by going to Asset Importer, Editor, Resources, and manually import the AI template here. 